Welcome to Job Form. Today's tutorial is going to cover how to enable save a form to continue later. In this case, we have this pre-built form and what we're going to do is head on over to settings, click on show more options, scroll down, and we're going to enable continue forms later. We're also going to click on customize, save and continue later. Now we can customize the message that appears and we can also edit the email subject. Now, if we want to send this with a custom email, we can go to advance and we can select one of the emails we've added previously or add a new email. In this case, we're good to go. We're good with the message that it's going to display. So let's save these changes. Let's go ahead and publish, open in a new tab. And in this case, we are already logged in, but you're going to see on the bottom, we have the saved button enabled. So if I click, for example, if I say Jorge Aguilar and we leave this pending because let's just say they're asking for an official ID and I don't have it available right now. So I need to save this. So let's go ahead and save it. Okay. Let's grab the shareable link. Let's go ahead and open it again. And there we go. We can continue where we left off. Now, what's ha what's going to happen if we do this in incognito mode where we are not logged in into Jot form? Let's go ahead and grab the form link. So let's copy this link. Let's open incognito mode. Let's go into this form. And again, we have the save, but save button, but we're going to see what we're going to do. So it's going to say or Aguilar and need support. And again, I forgot to add the, the file right here. So I'm going to save it for now and I'm not going to add the email yet. So I'm going to save. But since I am not logged into JotForm, I am being asked to create an account or I have the option to skip. So I have the option to use Google to sign in, Facebook, sign up with email, log in if I already have an account or skip create an account. Now, if I skip it, what it's going to do is I can add my email right here and it's going to send over the link. And that way I have the shareable link so I can have it by email or I could just grab it from right here. So those are the options that you have to enable save and continue later on Jotform. Well, we thank you all for watching.